Hello everyone, welcome to POC channel. Today I am going to showcase Colab setup as well as executing a sample machine learning from Colab. Colab is a great way to start building our machine learning model that provide a browser based uh, window there we can execute all Python code. We don't really require any installations or any configuration setup. If we have a Google account that's more enough. Let me go one by one. Just to go to Google and type Google Colab. So the first link welcome to Colab. So just to click here and this provide a pop-up with a few options. So here we have a welcome to Colab that, that giving us uh, getting started with the detailed uh, explanations and we have a new notebook link. So we can just click here and then open the new notebook as well. Let me go to welcome to Colab and then um, so see here uh, we, we have a video with the, with the great explanations. You can watch it for three minutes. And then uh, what is Colab? Allow us to write and execute a Python in your browser. So we don't really require any configurations uh, for this. Zero configuration required and uh, free access to the GPUs and TPUs. In case if you have any complex machine learning model building, we can utilize these options, GPUs and TPUs. Also, it's a easily shareable one. We can download this uh, notebook and then share it with any of our friends. Let me go to the getting started. This is way it, it will look like. Um, so that the text as well as the code. If you just double click here, so we can edit uh, any of the details and then we can save it back. Similar way, the, the code look like this. We can just come here and then execute it here. So when you see this tick mark with the green, so the, the execution is completed. Similar way for the data science purpose, we have a lot of uh, predefined uh, uh, the libraries installed. We don't really need to install any of the libraries. If you see here, uh, they used uh, NumPy and then the plotting purpose, uh, they used the matplotlib. Um, we, we don't really need to install this, just, just, just import it and then use it. Similar way for the machine learning learning purpose, there is a lot of predefined options we have. Let me go one by one. Um, let me go to create a new Colab notebook. The new notebook window look like this. Um, so we, we have a title. So let me give the title. my first notebook and um, here we have the, the code window and then uh, the, ex the execution code window. Let me copy some sample code and uh, just to show you. Just to copy and the paste the code here and just execute it. That's it. So now if you see this green uh, tick so which means the execution completed, we can see the result here. So when you need to add more code, just click on this uh, uh, plus sign, the code, and then uh, you can execute the code. I'll, I'll copy some more sample code from here. That's it. All the codes are executed now, so we can see the tick mark with the green green tick marks nearby. And um, um, similar way, we can add the uh, the text in between the codes in case if you need to provide any commands or any detailed explanation for the code, we can add the text as well. Uh, let me show. Just click on this uh, plus text button, and then so that will give us the the window to write the text. extracting features and target here and then just to just to save it so we have a text over here um, so we, we can add all uh, the HTML we can add the HTML tags so suppose we need to modify the font
yeah we modified the font color here um, so you can just give the color green uh, and then just uh, save it back um, similar way we can move this uh, uh, in between the quotes so that uh, this will be a great uh, documentation when you when you come here and then refer this will be a great way to like see what what exactly this step is doing and then uh, the, the command center Similarly, we, we have other options. Uh, if you go to file and then the download, you, you can download this uh, notebook. Um, let me download. It's it's a download already. Um, so if you go to the folder, you see that uh, the file has been already downloaded and we can see here. Similarly, uh, there is a, a few more uh, useful options. If you go to edit and then notebook settings, this is the way we can set up the GPU and TPU. So you can just uh, select GPU and then save it. So if you see here, uh, it's connecting and initializing and it's done. So which means that notebook can able to use the GPU right now. So if, if you have any, any complex model building, we can use utilize this GPUs and the TPU options. So similar way you, you can set up it for the TPU as well. Just select a TPU and then save it. So you can see it's it's connecting and uh, it's 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 done. It's completed. Also, like if you see here the runtime, there is a, a, a one option run all, which which means like you can execute the complete notebook together. If you select run all, it, if you see here, it's it's executing the complete steps together. Similar way, we have uh, a few more options. Uh, one of the options is the command palette. This will provide, suppose if you need to open any new notebook, you can use that new no open notebook and then open settings, all those uh, shortcuts available here. We can utilize that. That's all about uh, this uh, Colab notebook setup as well as executing a few, a few Python code from the notebook. Um, thank you so much for watching. Please let me know if you have any other commands. Thank you.